Philippe, c'est le moment euh, tant Philippe. attendu. That's the uh, much expected time for the Frogans Award. Thank you very much uh, for giving me the floor. So, I'm calling the uh, members of the jury, Coralie Boulay, Sébastien Bachelet, Xavier Sans and Laurent Polini. Would you please join me on stage? Je, je vous invite peut-être à, uh, à prendre place, peut-être. Uh, maybe you want to take a seat, whatever. Are you comfortable standing? Are we missing someone? Yeah, Sebastian. Alors, euh, je, en, en deux mots, je vous explique comment la, la soirée va se, se passer. So, in a couple of words, tonight, in the Frogans Award, we are going to give four prizes, two of which will be awarded by the jury. So it's uh, for art, uh, artistic aspects, and for technical aspects. The second prize will be that from the social networks. So we looked at uh, the... There was some uh, activity on the... Uh, on Twitter accounts, and the last one will be awarded by the loudest applause in the room. So let's start. Coralie, good evening, Coralie. Thank you for joining us. Coralie Boulay, you are the director of the Digital Technologies, the School for Digital Technologies. Can you say a few words about your school? Yeah, hi. Good evening to all of you guys, because uh, there is a minority of women when we talk about technologies. So I set up a school to train young people to digital technologies. And uh, we talk about the technical aspects uh, we, t we talked about, but also to graphics and digital strategy. I'm uh, running this school from Paris. We have 100 students who work and uh, appropriate all and become familiar with all sorts of different technologies. Xavier, you are a professor at Paris Descartes University. Absolutely. I'm in charge of information and communication. We deliver uh, traditional diplomas and at Paris Descartes University, we have trainings and we are focusing on digital technologies and marketing as well. Thank you. Laurent Polini, you are a research engineer with the University of Évry and you took part in the Évry Hackathon. Yes, you're right. I'm also a teacher and professor with the IT department. So we have two different types of class. I have two different types of responsibilities. I am a professor, but I'm also the organizer of what we call an event called the Night of Computer Science. Thank you. Sébastien Bacholet has been with us for many different uh, FTCs. He was a former member of the ICANN Board of Directors and he still works with ICANN as a representative for European users. Yes, I was on the board, but now I'm working with the at-large advisory committee. And last week I was re-elected to AFNIC that manages .fr applications and the system behind which the .frogans that you cannot see and don't need to be interested in actually is managed because you always need an operational database or operational technical system. But I'm not working with them, so don't ask me how it works. I'm just a representative of uh, internet users sitting on, the, sitting on the board. Thank you very much, Sebastian, for being with us tonight. So, for the review, 
whatever you want. I'm going to call Aurélien to help me with the machine. We are going to take a look at the sites. This remote is broken. I need another one. Oh, the chair is broken. Sorry, it's not the remote, it's the chair. So could we find a decent, non-broken chair, please? Otherwise, I'm fine standing up. Okay, so there were six finalist sites for the uh, Frogans 2 that... There was a lot of freedom last time. It was e-commerce and surprised me. So these were two topics that were supposed to avoid uh, the uh, writer's or author's uh, fright. You know, that was why we had this surprise me uh, theme and we saw very beautiful things there. So those sites, well, we're going to play around with these sites right now together, but well, Aurélien is going to do that. I have no order of preference. We can do that the way you want. I have a list here. So my suggestion is we start with the Frogans Star Etralite. Etralite. So we'll spend a couple of minutes per site. So that's a site that looks like the Ivory Coast when it comes to the shape, and you have four sections that we can visit, and which give you access to um, the front end of an e-commerce platform so that you can buy traditional objects like uh, masks, beautiful images. So you can buy, create your basket. So, um, just talking for, for those of you who don't know these state of the, the, the status of Frogan's technology, this is just a demo, and those sites were created before the functionality was made available in FSDL. So it was a bit of a hacking operation here. So let's see what happens when we vignette the site. Okay. Other buttons, chairs, and you vignette in, vignette out. So, Etralite oh, was presented by the Frogans community of the Ivory Coast. So, the people that we saw in the video uh, earlier on. So, I think we've seen this one. Right? Yeah, they have a lot of items. Uh, for sale, so go for it, play with it. Fragrance Star I dash Tralai. Merci Aurélien. Si l'adresse vous plaît, elles ont été toutes retweetées juste avant le début de cette session. If you like it, we've uh, tweeted them as uh, as well. So um, feel free to tweet them as well. So that's uh, that's one. Let's move on to the next one. Um, let's pick one randomly. Uh, Frogans star peluche peluche. Alors c'est un site qui a été développé pendant le hackathon. So this site was developed during the hackathon at the University of uh, Every. It's about picking the upper and lower part of a teddy bear. So in this case, you have a, the choice between a bear and a bunny. Bear or bunny? 
<laughs> so I, we had a conversation earlier with the uh, the makers, the designers, and uh, they couldn't go further in terms of design. Um, but obviously, we could, you know, add uh, an endless number of of bears um, and possibly make this uh, an e-commerce site that could be used to sell bears and bunnies. Okay. Toujours au hasard. Uh, okay, next one. Again, random pick. Frogan's star chart. This is coming from a company called Absolus Conseil. They are based in Bordeaux. It starts with a disclaimer. I'll let you read it. So it's generated from a CSV file processed by a script to create FSDL elements. So it, uh, it's digital information which is translated into or transferred into charts. So this, um, this is what we get. Each piece of data is displayed at the bottom when you move your cursor over a given color. So we, here we have the same thing, but a crude. It reminds me a little bit of uh, the early days of Excel, Excel spreadsheets. So we have a, a nice vignette, which has nothing to do with the actual theme. Uh, is this a pie chart? It's, it looks like a pie chart. And again, I'm, I'm commenting here uh, as we're going. Then we have curves like this, dots, dots on a vertical axis, uh, then we have uh, dots that are connected by lines. Okay, I think I've, we've seen it all. So this is, this one once again is called Charts from Absolus Conseil, Absolus Consulting. We have three more. Frogans Star Storyvoir. Voilà, donc manifestement, uh, une plateforme de d'achat de. So, this is a site that where you can purchase electronics, computers, iPads, phones, smartphones, you name it. So you have your basket, your shopping basket. A slide, uh, en l'occurrence, static. You have a static slide where you could actually sign up, register, and uh, and then ask for your products to be shipped to you. That's Storyvoir. Okay. Okay. Et donc il m'en reste un. Ouais. And then we have one final one. Il m'en reste deux, en fait. As a matter of fact, two. So the next one is Fro Fro Frogans Star Frog Foot. Frog Foot. Donc là, un thème dans l'air du temps. Dans l'actualité. 
euh, où on voit donc les la présentation du which comes in a very timely fashion it's about football we have the trophy which is presented of the euro cup we have uh, a lot of information about the uh, the euro cup which is currently held in france and uh, the final is in early july voilà, donc les stades aussi a lot of detailed information about the different uh, venues chez vous ou ici dans la salle vous pouvez aussi naviguer vous-même ces sites Frogans puisque évidemment so you can navigate these Frogans sites they are online they were presented and published as soon as possible last week with version 102 of Frogans player for developers Parfait, merci. Thank you for that. Dernier site en compétition. And here comes the final one. Frequence Star Open. Proposé par Devgang. Coming from Devgang. Le groupe de développement Devgang. It's a development group called DevGang. So this is obviously very round. Different buttons you can click on. So once again, this is very much uh, an e-commerce site, uh, a lot of electronics, IT products. You can use it to send uh, text messages, emails as well. En vignette, ça donne quoi? And the vignette looks like this. S'enregistrer, si je m'enregistre. So if I sign up, you get a page. Well, it says coming soon. I guess that's for the launch of the platform. But if I want to connect. Right, you get this page. Une simulation de, de profil. So this is uh, just a mock-up profile. Voilà. Okay. Okay. Merci. Thank you. So, before um, turning to the jury, um, I would like to turn to you. Do you have any questions? Do we have any questions from the audience here or from anywhere else? Yes, it looks like no. Do we have a question? No question? Okay, very good then. Okay, well, I would like to then turn to the members of our jury. Uh, we would like to hear uh, what they have to say about these uh, different sites. Laurent Poligny from the University of Evry, what do you think? Well, I would like to make one comment. What's interesting is that uh, the first time we saw um, art was in caves. and. Uh, where there are no frames. Uh, and it's interesting that out of six, five have that frame, are using a frame. They look like framed masterpieces, um, which is uh, quite interesting. Um, just a comment. <laughs> I agree. I agree. The criteria are based on the specificities of uh, fragrance technology and uh, th therefore with the idea that you could get rid of a frame. Uh, and then in terms of content, dynamics, uh, adaptability to users, uh, uh, that's these are the things I was looking for. 
sortir du cadre et puis encourage uh, the uh, user to actually uh, enter the site to make it more appealing more attractive I, I agree with what you said um, but how, when you look at these sites the one for football it's um, it's a frame but it's it's a it's a ball So I think they've, you know, they've, of course, they've, we do have a frame, a, a rectangular frame, and it would be good if we could have something different. Uh, however, uh, some of these projects have obviously uh, uh, made an attempt to think out of the box, be out of the box. We have to keep in mind that these guys had very little time To, uh, to do their work. I, what I liked is in one of these sites that I could actually travel, discover local arts. So you discover the site and you discover a country. You discover local traditions. Um, I'm not influencing you know, the final result or uh, predicting the final result, but I like the, the fact that you discover I like the cultural approach. It's not just about selling. It's, uh, you know, sometimes sites are about IT because they sell IT. Frogans is not about IT. Even if you need to develop, to do some development work to present the site, I think you, we need to forget that uh, there is more behind Frogans than just technology. Combien um, j'apprécie cette évolution dans le projet. Maintenant, on peut tous les voir de. What's also great is that we can see them from home. Uh, they're not available to the general public yet, but I think we've come a very long way in the fact that we can now have them, uh, you know, all s at home uh, online is, is a big step forward. And I would like to congratulate the people who've worked, spent a lot of time on uh, these sites uh, to allow us to see this uh, the result of their work today so I'd like to announce the results of uh, the, uh, the selection um, there are two awards one artistic award the one we think it was the best had the best design in terms of from, from a, 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 an artistic standpoint which has had the most variety and then a second award to the most uh, technically advanced site and you may not see that much uh, technology you may not see the technology but there is a lot of technology behind some of these sites so these are the two awards we we identify so the artistic one the winner is uh, open the one which is in the top left Frogans Star Open. And the winner of the technical award, and trust me, we had some real IT experts here, is the one called Chart, the one with the dots. This one. So, congratulations to the two teams who developed these sites, and uh, we would like to thank the others for being part of the contest, and I hope that for the next Programs Technology Conference we will have much more contestants. Right, right. Uh, we're not, it's not over yet. It's not over yet. We have uh, two uh, additional awards. We have the social media. Uh, award since these sites were published with a program's address available to all they've been traveling only three days for only three days but 
There has been a bit of a buzz, so we have that social media award. I would like to call Gwenda Laudrin. Let me give you the, the mic to give us the name of the winner and the number of tweets. Well, we had a real battle over the past five, 15 minutes on, uh, online. Uh, and I think that we have a, a, um, a winner, Ivory Coast. Um, I Trelai. E Trelai, sorry. E Trelai. Côte d'Ivoire. Okay, perfect. Thank you. So we now have three winners. And we would also like to finally uh, uh, give you the award of the today's audience today's public we did the same thing during the during FTC 6 where we actually measured your level of excitement using a clapometer um, could we yes but to do that we need to switch off all mics so in order to have an unbiased measurement of the applause meter Okay, so in the meantime, we can stretch a little bit. Okay, let's just test the applause meter. I think you already calibrated it, right? Yes, I did. It is. It has been calibrated. Okay, I think I was outside. So here it is, the Fragrance Awards uh, and oui, the applause meter, which is now displayed on the screen. So once again, here are the final six finalists. Gwendal will be recording and measuring the sound volume reached for each site. Okay, the first vote is for Fragrance Star I or E Chalai. Hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> so, Okay, so this is Itralai coming from Côte d'Ivoire au village. And on the applause meter, we reached 52. The second site is Fragrance Star Frog Foot. Donc 
Frogfoot, c'était le site présenté par la communauté. Donc, so, Frogfoot est venu de Côte d'Ivoire, une fois again. Et nous avons mesuré 45 sur le applause meter. Prochain, Frogans, étoile. Next one is Frogans, star, open. Hold on, hold on. C'était Open de, du groupe Def Gang. So this was Open, Open from Def Gang Group. And we measured 60 on the applause meter. Alors, le prochain. The next one. Étoile. Fragrance. Star. Story War. Hold on, hold on. Okay, we have to do this one again, obviously, right? Donc, Store Ivoire. Okay, Store Ivoire. 73 on the applause meter. Alors le prochain, Frogans, étoile, peluche. Okay, the next one is uh, Frogans, star, peluche. The teddy bear bunny one. Fifty-six. And the last one is fragrance. Star. Star. Chart. Chart. Donc quarante trois pour chart. Forty three for chart. Et donc, belle main gauche, n'est-ce pas hein 
Eh bien, écoutez. Well, the winner is Storyvoir. Hâte mon trésor qui gagne euh, et je, je, je me rends compte qu'on n'a pas du tout parlé des prix mais we haven't talked about the actual awards awards are coming from partners of the uh, uh, the event therefore the winners so open charts and Storyvoir will all receive five fragrance addresses for themselves, for their friends or relatives, and a one-year free hosting once the FCR register is open for Internet users. And this will be as of October the 11th. So congratulations to the four winners. Je vais simplement euh, donner la parole, le micro. I would now like to give the floor to Victor, qui est là-haut. To uh, Victor. In the Frogons Awards, we're also going to Cite, euh, donc des gagnants ici. look at the, the people who tweeted or retweeted. So we're going to... Um, ainsi que l'hébergement de son so one more. Alors pour les retweets pour Frogan c'est toi l'open euh, le gagnant so est the winner is Devgan Spirit Devgan Spirit sorry that's the number of, for the highest number of retweets pour les retweets pour le site Frogan c'est toi the Frogan's uh, is Dazzy 1673 that's the Pour les retweets pour le retweets for Frogan Star Chart is Daisy 1693 again, and for Frogan Star Each Ally, it's Mr. MK. Merci beaucoup. Ceci conclut. Okay. Thank you very much. So, this is the end of the award ceremony. Uh, we're now going to go back to our final conclusions. Thank you, Philip.